Welcome to MAKE, Hands-On Intro to Engineering Design. This is Jordan Azar from the University of South Florida, and in this video I will show you my final project report of the Bluetooth RC car. This is the control system log diagram for my project, the Bluetooth RC car. You can see the basic schematic for the electrical components of the car. You can see that the Android phone is going to send commands to the Bluetooth transceiver which will send the commands to the Arduino and then it will distribute it to the module that will tell which motors to rotate and in which direction. I will now show you an animation of my project done in Autodesk Inventor. You're gonna see how these electrical components interact to make the car wheel spin to make the basic commands show the basic movements that the RC car will have. This is the animation of my project done in Autodesk Inventor. You can basically see the representation of the commands being sent to the phone that will make the wheel spin either backwards or forward and it's either going to be the left wheel or the right wheel that's going to be spinning or both at the same time if the both commands are sent. This is the finished project. You can see that the phone is there to be what is going to send the commands to the Bluetooth transceiver that's going to later send to Arduino and we're going to see these commands being put into action. What I'm going to show now are the basic commands that are each motor spinning in each direction. I just sent a 3 to a car which makes the left motor spin forwards a 4 to stop it and a 5 to make it spin backwards. Now I'm going to do a 6 to make the right motor spin forward, a 7 to stop it, and an 8 to make it spin backwards. Now I'm going to do distinct commands to control the RC car as if I were playing with it. So you can see I'm using distinct commands either at the same time or one at a time to make the car either turn or go forwards or go backwards as desired. As you can see you can very easily accomplish the direction that you want the car to go and where you want it to stop and how much you want it to turn before it goes either forward or backwards. This was Jordan Azar from the University of South Florida. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoy.